You're looking like you use me for a visa. Yeah. And I'm sick of it, man. I'm just, I just wish I never brought him here. It looks like you're using me for a visa, and I'm fed up with it. I just wish I had never brought him here. Angela Deem, one of the most infamous figures in asterisk 90 day fiance asterisk history, has been dropped by TLC, and the reason behind it is truly shocking. But that's not all. Michael's unexpected lawsuit might just be the final blow to Angela's career. Michael, your wife kept saying, give me my visa. That's your personal document. Understand? You can tell him to shut his I mouth around right now. My mouth. You know his reason to say today. I'm trying to educate you. Angela Deem's behavior towards Michael Isle Sammy on Asterisk 90 Day Fiancé Asterisk has been one of the most troubling aspects of their relationship. From the beginning, Angela's dominant and controlling nature was clear, but as their relationship progressed, these traits intensified. Angela was frequently seen yelling at Michael, belittling him, and making demands that crossed into verbal abuse. Her actions were just heated arguments, they often bordered on emotional abuse. Angela's explosive temper and harsh words became a regular feature of their interactions, whether accusing Michael of cheating or reprimanding him for failing to meet her expectations, Angela never hesitated to raise her voice and assert her dominance. Numerous instances showed Angela berating Michael, reducing him to silence or forcing him into submission. These outbursts weren't confined to private moments, they often occurred in public, in front of cameras, other cast members, and even Michael's family. One of the most concerning aspects of Angela's behavior was her need to control every aspect of Michael's life. She dictated what he could and couldn't do, monitoring his interactions with other women, even on social media. Angela's jealousy led her to make unreasonable demands, such as insisting that Michael delete female contacts from his phone or avoid working in environments where he might meet women. This level of control went beyond typical relationship boundaries and contributed to the toxic dynamic between them. As the show aired, many viewers expressed concern about the unhealthy nature of Angela and Michael's relationship. Fans were frustrated with TLC for continuing to showcase a relationship that seemed to cause real harm. Despite these concerns, TLC focused on the drama and ratings brought by Angela's explosive personality. The emotional toll on Michael was evident throughout the series, with clips showing him visibly distressed and struggling to cope with a partner more intent on control than love. In one particularly heart-wrenching scene, Michael is seen breaking down in tears after yet another confrontation with Angela. I feel like I'm, I'm an unwanted guest. Like, I, I wasn't treated like I'm a husband, you know? Like, I, I, I was treated like I'm just a nobody. That's just how I'll put it, you know, it's yeah. worth. I mean, every day we fight. It is, I'm telling you, deliver. Every day we fight, you know, we argue, you know? I mean, many things, I, I mean, it's a lot. For me to live, for me to have left rather, I mean, it's, it was, uh, it had gotten to, to my, to, to the point I couldn't just bear it anymore. And people were saying, oh, I, uh, I, I have another woman out there. I planned this and I never planned anything. I never, I don't have any woman here that I'm talking to or dating. I don't have any woman. Uh, the only woman I have is, uh, was... Uh, After enduring years of emotional abuse and public humiliation, Michael eventually reached his breaking point. It became clear that he could no longer tolerate the toxic environment created by his relationship with Angela, nor could he accept the way TLC had exploited his suffering for entertainment. This realization led Michael to take an unexpected step. He decided to file a lawsuit against both Angela and TLC. Michael's decision to sue TLC came as a shock, as it was an unexpected turn of events. In the lawsuit, Michael accused the network of deliberately exploiting the toxic dynamic between him and Angela to boost ratings, all while failing to protect him from the emotional and psychological harm he was experiencing. He argued that TLC had a responsibility to intervene or at least provide support, but instead they prioritized the entertainment value of his suffering over his well-being. Michael also claimed that the network stirred up drama to keep the tension high, ignoring the signs that he was struggling while filming. 
Rather than focusing on the cast's mental health, it seemed that TLC was solely concerned with maintaining their ratings. She said, badly by her. Whenever she's upset, she can do whatever she wants. And I, you know, the law here, yeah, I don't want any issue. I don't want any bad record of my name. So I tend to, you know, keep it cool. But to be honest, I was, I was scared. You know, sometimes when she's very upset, you know, mm. she made me after Phew. Michael's lawsuit, TLC found itself in a tough spot. The network, once considered untouchable in the reality TV world, was now facing serious allegations that couldn't be easily dismissed. As media and fans began to scrutinize Michael's claims, TLC felt the pressure and had to make a difficult decision about Angela's future on the show. Ultimately, TLC decided to part ways with Angela Deem, marking the end of her time on Asterisk 90 Day Fiancé Asterisk, this dramatic move signaled that the network wanted to distance itself from the drama she brought to the show. For Angela, this was a significant blow. Her reality TV career, which had made her a household name, came to an abrupt end, and the fallout from Michael's lawsuit severely damaged her reputation. The response from fans was mixed. Some were relieved, feeling it was about time Angela faced consequences for her behavior, which they believed had been overlooked for too long. They saw TLC's decision as a necessary step in addressing the toxic dynamics on the show. Others were shocked and disappointed, suspecting that TLC might be using Angela as a scapegoat to deflect attention from their own issues. The recent courtroom trial marked a dramatic new chapter in the saga of Angela Deem and Michael Ilesami. Angela Deem's behavior towards Michael Ilesami on Asterisk 90 Day Fiancé Asterisk has been one of the most troubling aspects of their relationship. From the beginning, Angela's dominant and controlling nature was clear, but as their relationship progressed, these traits intensified. Angela was frequently seen yelling at Michael, belittling him, and making demands that crossed into verbal abuse. Her actions weren't just heated arguments, they often bordered on emotional abuse. Angela's explosive temper and harsh words became a regular feature of their interactions, whether accusing Michael of cheating or reprimanding him for failing to meet her expectations. Angela never hesitated to raise her voice and assert her dominance. Numerous instances showed Angela berating Michael, reducing him to silence or forcing him into submission. These outbursts weren't confined to private moments. They often occurred in public, in front of cameras, other cast members, and even Michael's family. One of the most concerning aspects of Angela's behavior was her need to control every aspect of Michael's life. She dictated what he could and couldn't do, monitoring his interactions with other women, even on social media. Angela's jealousy led her to make unreasonable demands, such as insisting that Michael delete female contacts from his phone or avoid working in environments where he might meet women. This level of control went beyond typical relationship boundaries and contributed to the toxic dynamic between them. As the show aired, many viewers expressed concern about the unhealthy nature of Angela and Michael's relationship. Fans were frustrated with TLC for continuing to showcase a relationship that seemed to cause real harm. Despite these concerns, TLC focused on the drama and ratings brought by Angela's explosive personality. The emotional toll on Michael was evident throughout the series, with clips showing him visibly distressed and struggling to cope with a partner more intent on control than love. In one particularly heart-wrenching scene, Michael is seen breaking down in tears after yet another confrontation with Angela. This trial was anything but ordinary, with moments that seemed straight out of a reality show and packed with jaw-dropping twists that turned everything upside down. One of the biggest shocks came when Angela's private investigator took the stand. Hired to dig up dirt on Michael, he ended up clearing his name instead. The courtroom was stunned as the investigator revealed that, despite his extensive search, he found no evidence to support Angela's claims. Instead, he described Michael as a loyal and honest individual, a major blow to Angela's case and leaving her legal team scrambling. As the trial progressed, it became clear that the momentum was shifting in Michael's favor. Angela, who had entered the courtroom brimming with confidence, began to unravel as reality set in. The final blow came with the verdict. Michael was found not guilty. Angela's reaction was explosive. 
She started shouting at the judge and jury, desperately clinging to her version of events. Her meltdown created chaos in the courtroom, prompting security to intervene as she let her anger out. In stark contrast, Michael remained composed, quietly absorbing his victory with a visible look of relief, highlighting the dramatic difference between his calm demeanor and Angela's outburst. You've always disrespected your husband in public, every single place. Okay. To the level that even a fly cannot respect him. Courtroom victory was a game changer, marking a significant turning point after years of emotional abuse and public humiliation. As he walked out of the courtroom with his head held high, it was clear that this win was not just a legal triumph but a personal breakthrough. For Michael, it symbolized a chance to escape the toxic relationship that had burdened him for so long. With the past finally behind him, Michael looked forward to a new chapter with hope and excitement. In interviews following the trial, he spoke about his plans to rebuild his life, focusing on his own happiness and eagerly anticipating new opportunities and experiences he hadn't been able to explore before. His future plans revolved around finding peace and creating a life free from conflict and drama. He hinted at pursuing new personal and professional ventures, but emphasized that his main goal was simply to find joy in whatever he chose to do next. Meanwhile, Angela Dean was grappling with the fallout from her defeat. Desperate to salvage her reputation, she took to social media with a series of rants and interviews, trying to spin the situation in her favor. However, her attempts seemed to backfire, as her bitterness and anger only intensified public criticism. Angela lashed out at Michael, TLC, and even viewers, refusing to take responsibility for her actions. Many criticized her for being unable to move on from her loss, with comments like, 100% agree with Michael, sue them, and I hope Michael is getting therapy for the PTSD Angela probably gave him. What are your thoughts on this situation? Let me know in the comments, and before you go, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.